tornado workout, okay, starting with feet shoulder width apart, crouching down or squatting down, forearms on knees, okay, you're gonna be doing two hands, so it's about 50%, trying to keep the neck and the head still and breathing, okay, trying to shake it out like you're shaking a towel, flicking through the wrists, so we can get that battle rope moving all the way down to the end. Okay, then what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the battle ropes down, just stand beside it, okay, and you're gonna complete one burpee. Just a little, not too intense. Just get down nice and safe, stand up, and then you're gonna jump over the middle of the battle rope, perform another burpee. All right, so do it nice and slow, so you, you don't overcook yourself for the warm up. then you'll go grab the battle ropes again. So just do that for another 10 seconds again. Same action. Okay, so for the warm up, you can complete three sets of that. Okay, the next action I want you to do after you've done the battle rope from there is go into a squat. Just beside the ropes again, yep, and just jump over it. Okay, and then a squat. Okay, and then 10 seconds with the battle rope again. Again, keeping it about 50%. Again, complete three rounds of that. That should take you up to about two minutes. Should get you nice and warm and prime for the workout. Okay, make sure you have a break before you just start the working phase. All right, once you're all ready, okay, so you're gonna do this at your best intensity. All right, you're starting with two hands, getting in that position again. Okay, you're gonna go hard as you can for 10 seconds. All right, keep the head still, head up. All right, then put the battle ropes down, straighten them out. You're gonna stand one side of it and you're gonna complete one burpee each side. All right, and then jumping over it. All right, once you're done both sides there, you go back to the start. Now you're gonna complete 20 seconds with the battle rope, your best effort. Okay, so shaking that all the way down. Okay, and then you're gonna complete one burpee each side. All right, now if you can't jump in like Haley's doing with the burpee, just show them a regression with the burpee. Okay, so it's just getting down safe and then stepping up, okay? Then the final one, you're going for 30 seconds with a battle rope, you get the idea, okay? And then you're gonna complete one burpee either side, okay? So again, getting, make sure you do it safely. We're trying to create movement here. All right, the next sequence, all right, you're gonna break for about a minute, one to two minutes here, okay? Then you're gonna conform, perform the same action with the battle rope, so that stays the same. All right, so you go back to 10 seconds, okay? And then you're gonna perform a squat, frog squat, sorry, next to it, okay? Which is a little hop up and then jumping over. So using the legs now. So squat and a little hop, okay? Just to make it safer on the joints. All right, same as before, you go to 20 seconds, okay? So do your best effort and then you do the frog squat either side and that carries on for 30 seconds as well. All right, then after you've done the 30 second lot and squats either side, okay, you rest for one to two minutes. And then the final action, you start back at 10 seconds. All right, and you're completing the burpee and the squat together beside the battle rope. So you do a burpee, okay. All right, then you complete the frog squat here. Yep, and then jump over and then burpee and frog squat. All right, and then you go back to the battle rope, you do 20 seconds, same again, with both actions beside the battle rope, same for 30 seconds, then you'll rest for one to two minutes, okay, and then you'll go through this sequence for 20 minutes all up.